Well, it's hard to find a team that's much hotter than Legacy Volleyball right now. The Sabres have won three straight after dropping the conference home opener, but their record is matched by the crosstown rival Demons. Bismarck visiting the Sabres sanctuary tonight for sole possession of fourth place in the WDA. Demons take set one and they start off set two with a point from number two. That's Jordan Rude dropping the hammer at the net. Sabres would rally to a lead from there. Five straight points, including three aces from Cambry Volk at the back line. Demons down, but not out. Something they proved all night as Taylor Meyer sends a shot opposite court for the kill. A team high 17 on the night for her as the Demons win a 3-2 thriller. St. Mary's in Mandan in a battle for their first conference win on the season. The Braves coming out fast as Anna Lyles decides a push is just enough for the first point of the contest. That puts Mandan ahead. The Saints would settle in midway through the first half. They get back to back points from Lily Coonan on the front line. This one back and forth all night. Lyles proving to be a difference maker up there at the net with another point as it goes the distance. Mandan wins. Meanwhile, Century earns a road sweep. Let's move over to Class B, one of the top teams in the state, Dickinson Trinity in its home opener against Glen Ullen. Bearcats junior Cassie Christensen gives her team a spark as this kill goes off a Titans defender. But Titans freshman Celia Christensen responds as she directs a light kill in front of the Bearcat defense. The two teams back and forth once again. Paige Cranzel using a push that just crosses over the net. That's good for a Bearcats point, but... Bella Kobosh powering a kill through the net here. That's good for a Titans clean sweep. Back east, it's a Region 5 battle between Shiloh Christian and Wilton Wing. Skyhawks up a set, and a big reason is because of Harper Wrigley in the middle. Blocking that one with ease, that keeps her team ahead. Plenty more where that came from for the Skyhawks. This time, Olivia Nelson fighting through the block. That's good for another point. Wilton Wing trying to call their way back in it. Sophia Crush with a more than appropriate last name as she crushes it through the back line, but it's too little too late. Shiloh wins in a sweep. A couple more scores in Class B. Hazing gets the road win 3-1. to one. Central McLean gets back in the win column. Flasher, Southheart, and Linton h &B all pick up road wins as well. well. A trio of games headlined the WDA soccer slate tonight, but none better than Mandan and Minot. The team separated by just three points in the standings. Mandan having won back to back games coming into tonight, but there was no difference maker tonight. No separation between the Braves and Magi. They play to a draw in the Magic City 1 1. Bismarck picks up a 4 1 road win and Legacy rolls to a 5 1 win at home. The Region 1 Girls Golf Championship taking place today. Linton HMB Lions take home the title. The Lions had three golfers finish in the top 10, including medalist Addie Robbins. It's year one of the relaunch for Bismarck State's rodeo program, and they're already making waves. Both Mystics programs nationally ranked early in the season. Here's the men's top 25, where BSE finds themselves ranked number four in the entire nation. Dickinson State not far behind at number 15. They're all chasing Montana State, which is where New Salem's Cole Gerhardt is number one in men's all around.